The build-up to the Rango began yesterday when Haman Sentongo stormed Sembabale police station with 110 critique ballot papers in favor of his rival, Dr. Eli Muhumza. However, later in the day, Sentongo turned up to witness the tallying of results from the 200 polling stations in Sembabale's two constituencies, Remiaga and Maogola. Tallying began at 11.30 p.m. and ended at 7 this morning. Sentongo, who was accompanied by his longtime friend Remyaga MP Theodo Sechikubo, rejected results from some polling stations. <laughs> Police then intervened to protect the returning officer Latif Ngonzi as he prepared to declare the results. We are correcting mistakes. No, but no, 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 after realizing that it may be a lost cause, Sentong and Sechikubo walked out of the hall at about 7.20 a.m., just as the returning officer announced the results. I declare Mumuza Eli, who has obtained the largest number of votes, <coughs> to be elected as a district chairperson for Sembabwe District. Sentongo's camp claims that the election was rigged and the best solution is a cancellation of the results or else he goes to court. He just went ahead and declared fake results. I won't respect at all any results that are going to be read and declared by the returning officer Latif Ngozi when I've raised these objections when he was still under his <laughs> ambit and power. But Dr. Muhumza, Sentongo's long rival, this is the beginning of the end of a long drawn out political war. He has twice lost to Sentongo, who is a former National Youth Council chairman. I want to say that this is the will of the people of Zimbabwe, so you can only throw the will of the people of Zimbabwe. He's not throwing me out. I did not vote. I only voted one vote. The rivalry between what is seen as the MP Sechikubo and Minister Sam Kutesa's camps is blamed for Zimbabwe's political fights. And it seems this state of affairs will continue now that Dr. Muhumza of Kutesa's camp defeated Haman Sentongo of Sechikubo's camp. However, what the people of Sembabwe hope for is to see the leaders unite like they have said. Sudirbi Arhanga, NTV, Sembabwe.